at this one and say there was like everything before Milton, everything <laughs> after Milton. Yeah. It, these true. are just markers, uh, and this is a storm that will be remembered. This was a huge rainstorm, and if you remember the past few days, we've been talking about it because oftentimes you hear about the storm surge, you hear about the wind, but you don't often hear about the rainfall. But we've been trying to hammer that point home that we would see a strip of 12 to 18 inches of rain north of the center, and indeed that is exactly what happened. Look at St. Pete. 18 inches of rainfall in and around Tampa, 12, 13 inches, even eastern parts of Pasco County around Dade City, around a foot of rain, and that extended well inland. In fact, in some areas, it's about a once in a 500 year event, believe it or not. A very, very rare event uh, in parts of our area. All right, so what I want to show you now is uh, actually, for some reason, this clicker's not working. There we go. I'm just going to use the, uh, the keyboard there. All right, so this is an interesting graphic. How many October's worth of rainfall did Milton produce and in Tampa it was five October's worth actually more than that in that purple that's at least four times what we would normally see during the month of October in Tampa uh, our normal is right around 2.3 inches of rainfall and the last thing I want to I want to leave you with here is we are going to see and we are already seeing river flooding you saw some of the pictures video that was just sent into us the Anclo River is one river that we want to focus in on uh, another river the Hillsborough River that is cresting now but it's going to take a while to go down uh, in addition the little Manatee River that is still going up a little bit it will eventually crest and go down as we head towards the weekend the Manatee River as you can see is already falling and last but not least the Alafia River that is still about to crest these are all ba ba basically in major territory, but that will also go down. So it looks like we're going to be dealing with the river flooding for at least the next few to several days, guys. Well, that and everything else that goes along with uh, the yes. storm of this size. Thank you, Jeff. Still ahead.